Hello well, everybody. So I've had the iWatch Series 5 for about maybe three weeks now and it's a great watch. I mean it's very functional. It's got a lot of fun things you can do with it. It's very convenient. Uh, I did purchase the GPS with a Wi-Fi option so I can not only make receive calls, I can send receive texts, uh, even emails as well. So if I leave my phone at home or if I've forgotten it in the car, you know, I'm, I'm left, you know, I'm not left a lot of communication. And, you know, if you're an Apple Pay user, it's it's perfect. Though, you know, going through all of its functions and apps and everything, which the iWatch will mirror the applications on your phone, um, while going through all these and testing them, there's one app in particular that caught my attention and I wanted to test it out. And this is the uh, Compass app. So uh, Apple uh, preloads a Compass on their iWatch as they do on their iPhone as well. And I've always wondered, uh, since I've had this, is how accurate is it? Now, I'm a Compass guy. And what that means is whenever I go hiking or camping, especially for long distance, and especially the type of terrain, I use a lensatic compass. Now, for those of you who don't know what a lensatic compass is, it's the compass, it's the military issue compass that flips open, has the eye guide sight. Uh, it's a lot of fun to use. It's, it, you know, it's really easy to learn. And this is made by Kamenga, C-A-M-M-E-N-G-A, -M -M -E which is the actual distributor manufacturer distributor for the military issue compass so how much more um how much more reliable can get than you know than a, a piece of um, a compass issue to the military so i wanted to test out the accuracy between the compass that's preloaded on the iWatch and as well uh, i purchased a a uh, compass called Pro Compass that's found on the Apple Store for iWatch, and I wanted to test that as well, so to see how well um, that manufacturer's version works. So, from what I understand, is the way that the compass works on the iWatch and how the compass works on all other applications is it uses GPS. Now, for the watches that don't have GPS, it uses the gyro sensor within the watch. So, depending on the model you got it's going to give you on a possibly different reading but for this intended purposes i just want to test the accuracy uh between the uh the compass on the iwatch and an application that i purchased for 99 cents now the lensatic compass that i purchased um it's it's a magnetic compass meaning that it towards point it points towards magnetic north uh depending on the type of compass user you are either you prefer magnetic north or you prefer true north uh, I personally, I like Magnetic North because it's a lot more fun to use. When I go out and I take a map with me to read a map, I like to uh, kind of push myself and make sure that, that I, I keep my scale up. So uh, let's go ahead and compare and see what happens. All right, everybody, welcome back to the results of our experiment. So the two bearings in the middle, that is, those are the bearings from the lensatic compass. And the line in the middle is a magnetic north reading, and the line to the left of it is the true north reading at a declination of at about 15.3 degrees here found in the Pacific Northwest. Bottom lower corner, you'll find the magnetic readings for the iWatch at four degrees, and that's a big difference and the pro compass at about seven degrees. That's even worse. Now, the right bottom corner, there you have the true north readings for the iWatch at about six degrees, and uh, the pro compass at about five degrees. Again, these are significant differences from the magnetic readings from the compass. Um, the true north uh, bearings uh, look to be a little bit better. They're only off about a, about a degree between each other, but still not dependable. All right, guys, what did we learn? So the applications for the iWatch and the apps you can buy on the App Store are not very good indicators for true bearing. And that's why I recommend that you purchase a magnetized compass. I recommend a lensatic compass. Um, they're the most reliable. 
uh, compasses like at REI, Camp World, other places where they sell exclusively, you know, outdoor stuff. It's great to purchase there. And the price is well worth it, you know, because if you're out long distance, you want to make sure you have something that's reliable and, uh, and gives you true bearings and true readings, okay? All right, so I hope this was uh, informative. And uh, if you liked uh, what you saw today, go ahead and uh, hit that subscribe, hit that like button, and hit notifications. Uh, from here out, we'll be uh, comparing uh, manufacturing products for different outdoor use, okay? Well, I appreciate the time, and um, be safe out there.